welcome to jasonnewland.com. My name is Jason. This is your daily hypnosis session. Today I'd like to just talk about rejection. Not a popular subject, I imagine, with really anybody. Also very, can be a very painful thing. Um, to be rejected in whatever way that you may have been rejected and I imagine it's a guess but we all have it sometime so close your eyes just for a few minutes if it's safe for you to do so and this session really is for those of you that have had rejection in the past or maybe going through it now. This session is specifically for you to move on from that situation which was painful and difficult. But now that you can build that strength up inside you those resources of positivity and that knowledge that actually you're better off without that person that rejected you. That actually no one can really reject you. It's all about how you react to other people's stuff, to other people's ideas and prejudices and opinions. And we all have them, we all have opinions and ideas. And Does it make us right? Does it make them wrong? Does it make them right, us wrong? Or is it just a bunch of ideas and opinions? And how can someone really reject us? All they're doing is working from their own mind. It's not real, is it? Because without our feelings and our responses, it's just a conversation that we've had with that person. Or it's just something that they've said, if we add to it, we take it home with us, we allow those feelings to grow, it becomes much bigger than it needs to be, so maybe realising that no one can really reject you. No one has that power to hurt you. No one can really do anything to you without you giving your permission. Why be affected by it? Why allow anybody to have that power? Is that fair on you? Don't you deserve more than that? Aren't you worth more than the person seems to think to you? Can't you allow yourself to really get in touch with the fact that you 
really can move on from someone rejecting you. Don't let rejection get in the way of future happiness. Because if it's a person that's rejected you, there'll be someone else that won't. There'll be someone else that actually appreciates you. Someone that really gets you and values how wonderful you are. Don't let this get in the way of you and your happiness. Because you deserve to be happy. You deserve to keep the power in your mind. Not to give it away to someone else. Hold on to that remote control for yourself. Don't give it away. That way you can never really be rejected. It can just be a lucky escape. Because why would you want to be with someone that doesn't want to be with you? Isn't that just a formula for unhappiness? Value yourself and remember that you are in control of how you feel. And it's okay to have emotions, whatever they are. What isn't okay is allowing someone else to really hurt you. It's not okay to allow one person to get in the way of your future happiness. Move on and imagine they're just an obstacle to jump over and move on into the future. Your future happiness. Always remember the rejection is just that, just a word. You're the one that adds the emotion to it, and there's no need to do that. So just allow yourself to relax and be calm and move on and enjoy the rest of the day feeling wonderful.